Yeah, that's really nice. Pretty cool. But you definitely don't want to... Now this right here would be ideal. It's fairly quiet. But, uh, except for the cars going by, but I'm really not out in the middle of nowhere right now. It's just a, a little park here in Greenbrier, Tennessee. It's out in the, it's out in the country. But, uh, anyway, uh-huh. Hey, everyone. James here. Yeah, I wanted to uh, make a video today about camping and survival tips while you're camping. Uh, it's always nice to camp next to a creek, as like you can see behind me here. But you don't want to camp right next to something like that. Even though it sounds really good, uh, you can't hear things moving around uh, away from you, like in the woods and sticks and twigs breaking. Something sneaking up on you is what I'm trying to say. If you're asleep in your tent, you know, like right here and you're right next to that, you're not going to hear something or somebody creeping up on you. Uh, also, uh, well, it's just not a good idea to, to camp right next to something like that. But uh, let's take a little walk on down here. Uh, this is a pretty nice little creek. It, uh, on the other side of that big berm right there is Greenbrier Lake. And uh, it spillways down to this creek right here. But let's take a little bit further walk down here. Anywhere where there's running water, you really don't want to camp right next to it for the reason I just explained, because you can't hear if something's coming up on you in the middle of the night, especially if you're asleep in your tent. Uh, of course, if you've got a camper uh, top on the back of your truck, like I do, I don't know if you can see it over there, but uh, anyway, let's walk down here for a second. Now this would be a pretty cool spot camp out if it wasn't for that running water right there of course you're still close to the the little waterfall up there too since so you still wouldn't be able to hear if something's coming up on you out through there or whatever whatever you whatever have you it's definitely not a good idea for that another reason why you don't want to camp like right here if it was uh Aside from that right there, if it was just a regular creek without a little lake on the other side, you don't know what it's doing weather-wise five miles up that way. And if you're asleep in your tent right here, and there's a big storm five miles away, you're liable to drown. It's called flash flood. So you don't want to you don't want to camp right in a creek bed, even though sometimes it's uh, really nice. Some of the small rivers and creeks have the flat rock bottoms too, not just gravel. Like, like I just showed you there. But yeah, this is a real nice little creek. But uh, definitely do not want to camp right next to loud water. Could definitely possibly save your life. But uh, you want to get down to where it's more, more quiet. You can still be next to the creek. You just don't want to have all that running water right there in the middle of the night while you're in dream world. But uh, now we're coming on down to a little bit more quiet area. And this would be an ideal little spot to camp out right along through here like this. But uh, anyway, hope we learned something today. But yeah, till next time, have fun, enjoy the great outdoors, stay safe, peace out.